This pathway has been developed to support patients and physicians to access high quality care in a timely fashion. The main mission of the pathway is really to provide patients with sooner, safer, smarter care. So it's it, in the patient first review, in the, it, Tony Dagnoni did a patient first review and patients told us that while they loved the care they received at different points in their care, they really didn't like the transitions between it and often they were quite lost. So the pathway is really a way to streamline and smooth out that patient flow and ensure that they get the appropriate care, the right care, at the right point in time. It's improved the health care system by decreasing the average length of stay and basically if you decrease the average length of stay that means that basically we can put more people through the system in a shorter period of time and therefore be able to work on the wait list. My name is Cindy Dumba. I'm from Regina and I got a total knee replacement. After surgery I feel much better of course the arthritic pain is gone and my surgeon's been happy with my progress. Um, I look forward to getting out and exercising a little bit more and doing some of the things I used to do in a changed way. Well, the benefit of the pathway is that the patients are able to come to one place and get all the information that they need. A patient would come into their physician's office and go through the standard assessment that a, that a physician always puts patients through for joint replacement. Family physicians are the most trusted care providers. So the physician would then refer the patient to the multidisciplinary clinic. The multidisciplinary clinic is really a great system. Um, you're, you're seeing your doctor, you're seeing a surgeon, you're seeing physiotherapists, occupational therapists, nurses, you're getting the whole gamut of, of healthcare professionals providing you with the best care you can get. It has an educational role in uh, teaching people about uh, what the hospital experience is going to be like, much like uh, the ADAPT teaching program does. It fits them with equipment that they might need beforehand, raised toilet seats or walkers, and it gives them an exercise uh, program that they can participate in and encourages them towards weight loss. Well, I just think I, I'm so thankful that the, uh, the region is now giving us, or our healthcare system is now giving us the opportunity to educate ourselves, to become more involved in our own care. Um, we, instead of going into surgery afraid and not knowing what's going to happen, the, this is so much easier on us. It's so much nicer to know exactly what's going to happen. We can have questions answered. Patients who were uh, taken care of prior to the time the pathway was implemented and patients who've been taken care of with the pathway show a 30% increase in function at six months. So I think that's a really significant thing that people have, are showing a 30% improvement above the counterparts who did not go through the pathway. I had a knee replacement and uh, it, the surgery was done on June, June the 9th of this year. And I also had one on the other, the other leg about seven and a half years ago. It's the first knee I didn't get. Uh, I didn't get physio. Uh, oh, just about three times or so, a few times after surgery, and and now I'm getting it regular. And uh, I think this is great. It it certainly does help and gets gets a person mobile a lot quicker. All we care about is getting rid of that pain, the, the before surgery pain. Um, you know. Naively, we may think that it, we're going to go back to what we were before the pain started, but that's not the case. You know, there's a life change to be made after surgery, and uh, the education is key. We're really hoping that all family physicians in the province will learn about the pathway, will know how it can support their patients, and will start to use the pathway as another vehicle to really improve patient care. This pathway really stresses that the family physician is the center of a patient's care and it keeps the family physician engaged and involved at every step. Family physicians who use the pathway once come back again and again and again because their patients report to them. Their journey is, is consistent, they receive high quality care, they receive it quickly and they feel supported. Well my hopes are that the pathway will continue to grow and that we will be seen as an option for patients and their healthcare providers. I hope that people see the pathway as a place where patients can come to get the knowledge and information that they need about their diagnosis and I really hope that people see the pathway as a place where patients can come to get the treatment that they require to make their lives better from a pain point of view and also from a functional point of view. Well I think that statistically you can just take a look at what's happened to our length of stay since the pathway has been instituted. And with the pathway, our length of stay has come down considerably. 
um, and it hasn't compromised patient care and if anything I think it's actually made it better. So I think that you know the numbers speak for themselves that it is a good thing.